Hey everybody, it's your boy, hashtag TikTok dad here, just popping in to say, I know most of you know me for my viral internet videos. Get out of here! Join the TikTok! But that's not all who I am. I'm not just hot trends and product placements. I'm also a little bit of an artist. And I thought I'd take this time to show you. Han Solo was a motherfucker, so Jimmy Carter put bees in his brains. He was born under the grain skies of America, when the sons of man walked as one, smiling at each other through false faces made of silicone, while actually traveling in a million unique directions at once. His father was a butcher, who sold substance only of his own body. When his last bit was used, he closed up shop and vowed to never eat man again. Hurricane Sandy, Sandy Hook. The fat kid from son-in-law was in the sandlot, but not the sandlot too. Lego my ego, super ego, and id. A cornered animal will attack unless it has wings to fly high above the oppressions put forth by primal aggressors and over-anxious foes. But if wings are clipped and tossed in sweet baby rays, they become a delicious delectable treat. But a fate worse than death if fed to the beast from which they came. Han Solo's father learned why the caged bird sings, and his son had the voice of an angel. He took a job at a hotel on the moon where demons came to reheat their eternal flames. It paid 13 lava lamps an hour, which was minimum wage at the time. When they hung the sign that read, Who's for Akatani? He knew his days were numbered. You see, Han Solo had four eyes, two on his face like most men, and one on his back to watch for the baloney daggers the bishops used to threaten his every step. The fourth was on the sole of his right foot and served no purpose at all. The gift of foresight is more a curse if you must buy two pairs of contact lenses at a time. When he spoke, most people didn't listen. Beetles bit their eardrums as they slept in moss, and that's the way they liked it. But if a bear shits in the woods and no one's around to see it, how can we pretend to know that bear's business? Who do that voodoo? Wesley Snipes and Tu Wong Fu. Thanks for nothing. He didn't have a crate, so he stood upon an old dog's back to preach on street corners. You don't need a million voices to be heard by giants if you're the only one who isn't afraid to speak. Silence was broken by his soft soprano and mountains shook with fear. If he continued, others might listen. And that was the greatest danger of all. So Jimmy Carter put bees in his brains. Han Solo was a motherfucker! 